Welcome to the Spendwise Moth Channel, your homemaking resource hub. This week for our Eat for $10 per week challenge, I spent $10.24 total. I got a variety of foods, including some reduced fruits and vegetables, some tomato sauce, some organic peppers, a gallon of milk for $1.39, two containers of sliced ham for $0.99 cents each, some hot Italian sausage for $0.93, cents, two bags of potatoes and sweet potatoes for $0.49 cents each, some reduced ripe bananas, and two lemons. I found a whole wheat bread recipe that uses lemon juice in it, and it is my new favorite recipe that I've ever tried. I will leave a link to it in the description box below. It calls for white wheat in the recipe, but I tried using red wheat flour today to see if it worked as well, and it turned out great. As usual, I keep out as much food as I can use fresh before it spoils and freeze the rest. When you're trying to live on a tight food budget, it's always nice when you can find good deals, like I found at our mall pizza place that sells huge leftover pizzas for $3 each. They freeze them throughout the day, and you can purchase them for less than the cost of the ingredients. We've had company for the last two weeks, and we've taken turns cooking meals. It's nice to try meals that other people make, and we've had some unique meals as we've tried to use the food I have in the freezer combined with sale items. Most of the creations have turned out pretty well. We've also made homemade waffles, and I've used cold cereal that I purchased on sale in the last couple of months for breakfast. We've made some homemade crumble cookie clone recipes that turned out really well. No need to pay $4 for a cookie when you can make a batch for yourself for almost the same price as one cookie. Here's some of the leftovers I've had in the freezer. By making copycat recipes of your favorite restaurant meals, you can have your favorite meals for a fraction of the cost and don't have to worry about a tip. I make copycat recipes for all of the Olive Garden soups, the Macaroni Grill Rosemary Bread, and lots of others. You feel like a good chef when you can duplicate things you can buy in a restaurant. Thanks for watching the Spendwise Moms channel. Please subscribe for more videos like this.